Daily Devotionals for September 7th. Today's scripture reading will be Hebrews 11:11. 11, 11. By faith, Sarah herself also received strength to conceive seed. And she bore a child when she was past the age, because she judged him faithful who had promised. Are you holding on to promises? Has the Lord spoken to you like he did Sarah? You know, Sarah was 90 years old. She laughed. She thought, this couldn't happen. I'm way past. And scripture said she was way past childbearing years. However, God said, no, you know, is anything, is anything too hard for God? That was a question he asked her. You know, if the Lord has given you a promise, I mean, you know, in your heart of hearts, that God has spoken to you about something, then he will bring it to pass. He can't lie and he makes a promise. Here's the thing, we need to come into alignment with what he has said and we need to be doing our part. She needed to conceive. Now, um, it is true she had a husband and obviously something hadn't worked all their married life. I don't know how long they were married, probably a long time. You know, she was 90, Abraham was 100. But apparently, I'm thinking the problem rested in her body that she was barren because once she conceived seed, okay, and she had Isaac, when Isaac was about, I don't know, 38, 40, something like that, that's when Sarah died. And remember, Abraham married again. He married Keturah and he had six sons with her so i believe the problem was with sarah and probably that the lord kept her barren for his purpose so that she would bring forth a promised child by faith in god's timing so you know we also god has made us promises we need to believe him but do our part we can't be expecting him to do his when we're walking over here, <clears throat> excuse me, doing something else, okay? It just doesn't happen that way. Um, Hebrews 10, 23 says, let us hold fast the confession of our hope without wavering, for he who promised is faithful. So that is what we must do. Be in alignment with what God has promised to us, okay? He's made us promise, then are we doing our part? He will remain faithful. Don't lose hope, okay? If he spoke it, he will bring it to pass. But we must be in the perfect alignment with him and doing what he's asking us to do. Sometimes, sometimes we don't want to do what he says, but he can't complete what he has to do until we do our part, okay? All right, and I like that, the fact that it was Hebrews 11, 11. Bob always said when he saw 11, 11, it was saying that God was stretching forth his hand a second time. All right, so till next time, be blessed. And if you enjoy our YouTube channel, remember, subscribe and uh, share it with others, okay? Thank you.